Hey guys, Claytor here. Welcome back to the channel. Today is Saturday, September 21st. But anyways, it is the first round of Minion War. And guess who we just matched with? That is correct. A member of the family. <laughs> so it's going to be a very interesting a war for us, obviously doesn't get much stronger than uh, Seven Days Departed and Gypsy Danger, but uh, it will be a challenge. So it's the first time that uh, I have been facing Seven Days Departed. So we'll see what we can do. Um, it looks like that they have 21 uh, custom Daichin and then the rest, which will be nine uh, Hathors. So I think I'm gonna start by using my blue team versus one of the Hathor defenses here. So let's see, I think I use, I'll go with this one. There's nothing much to think, you know, if um, I get the blue matches, chances are that uh, we'll do well. If I don't, then I don't. Um, so this is the team that I've been using against um, red tanks. So let's see if we can come up with a win. Oh, that's fantastic. Already a blue diamond. So there's not much to think here. If we can get this and then charge, there we go. Um, the question is, which side is more dangerous? To be honest with you, I think this side is more dangerous because I can, to some extent, manipulate uh, the board and not, and uh, even charge Lemonwood while I don't have any any of my heroes charged. So the sequence here is a Persis, then Puphead, and then Athena. There we go. So now it's just a matter of how do we want to play this. Actually, I'm just going to go here. Even if he fires, that's okay. Um, there we go. He just got somebody in the middle, so that's not a big deal. Um, let's try to... Let's see. I want to bring those two blues up. Sorry. And then... So that should be enough to charge my other two blues, maybe. Let's see. For sure, pop hit will charge. Athena, not quite. That's okay. All right. So... Okay, now she will charge and that will be game. So thankfully, we did get the matches that we needed, so good outcome. Hey guys, unfortunately, I had an error with my second flag and um, was not able to record it. Uh, I just wanted to show you guys, this is the team that I used and this is the defense I faced. It was not an easy match. I, he went all the way down to the wire, I think. I was able to finish with maybe three minutes left. So uh, it was a tough one, but thankfully it worked. All right, guys, so this is my third flag and um, I'm going to use my second blue team versus uh, this half war tank team. Also, same idea. If I get the blue matches, I should be fine uh, dealing enough damage and um, I should come up with a win. All right, so we do have those two blue matches, which is great. But I don't want to go for either one of them because as you guys can see right in the middle, the three main lanes in the middle, there's absolutely no blue. So um, I think I'm gonna try to clean the middle up a little bit. I do not want to absolutely not go with the blue um, recommended match there because those greens are going to come up and then there will be another green match as you guys can see 
So what I think I'm going to do is basically bring this green match up. All right, great. Oh, it cascaded. Okay, that's okay. So now I can charge all of my heroes with a tile, so I do have the ability to charge them currently. So what I think I'm gonna do is use this Dragon Bomb. You will set up the red match and then subsequently the purple match, but it should be okay. They are not as charged yet. Now we can definitely go with the blue matches on the right and that should charge all of our heroes. There you go. So Hathor now is uh, going off. Now the question is, which side of the board do I want to attack? I think I'm going to go through the middle, just because those are the two most dangerous uh, heroes there, Hilda and Lemonwood. Now they both have dodge, so it is a little bit risky, but that's okay. I want to go ahead and take the risk. And the other thing that I always keep in mind is where else can I get a blue in case I don't kill them? And in this case, it will be the left side. I can just move that purple um, match and then we'll set up the blue uh, on the second move. So let's give it a shot. Oof, they are alive by a threat. Let's see. Hathor will definitely die with one blue tile. So let's go ahead and bring this purple match up. And then it's their turn to fire. Let's see. Oh, shoot. Please don't hit St Star Walker, please. Oh, good. All right, that's good. So now we have to use the bloom match on the corner, left corner. Now, check this out. Because the... Um, Elves, they have that passive where they share damage. There is a chance that if I throw this blue up, I am going to also kill Lemonwood. Let's see. <laughs> see, told you. All right, so now it's just a matter of cleaning up the board a little bit. Let's get my uh, taunter up. Oh, look at that blue match there. Beautiful. And I believe that is game. Wow, both of my blue teams worked really well today. All right, guys, for our fourth flag, I'm gonna go uh, purple heavy here since they have two yellows. Um, the goal is to try to get one of the yellows out and use Hunter as the last one hitting them uh, to inflict insanity. So let's give it a Try. All right. Not a lot of yellows. Or purple. I think I'm going to move this red to the right. All right, now I have another option. I can move this yellow, uh, get the dragon bomb. Or no, I'm going to go up because then it gives me two purples. There you go. the middle with this blue one and see if more purple come, purple come down I'm trying to see if I can set up a diamond but it doesn't look like I if I don't do this match this yellow match now I'm gonna miss an opportunity um, because yeah, let's come here and see if some more purples come up all right so that helped a little bit 
так. Right now, if I move this blue up, I'm gonna get the blue, then I'm gonna get the purple, then I'm gonna get the red at the bottom. Hopefully that will bring some things. If firewood, if lemon wood fires, that's okay. Because I don't have much charged. Alright, that was great. That should get me charged on the next. Man, but there's so many minions from Diochan. Um, let me see if there's any risk for Cascade here. I don't think so. Oh, man. All right, so I'll look first. Ah, I need it here. I don't know, Finley. See if I can damage him some. That is not enough. So I'm gonna have to go here. So I can get Lemon Wind to start dancing now. Yeah, I don't want to go on Diochan because she can prevent it from the dance. I'm going to go on Lemon since right now it's not that dangerous yet. Okay, good. So those two got there. Now, this is a good one. Let me get that purple to do a little extra damage in lemon wood. Oh man, he blocked. Should we use a mag now? Hope he doesn't hit um, Hunter. So if he hits Hunter, and it's gonna be tough for me. Please don't hit Hunter. can definitely use All right, for our last flag, I'm gonna use this red team um, based on what is left on the board. Um, this is probably the best option for me. Um, I do have a little bit of a dispel there with uh, Vaishali and then Marjana, uh, she has that part of her talent. So anyways, let's give it a shot. Uh, obviously we want a red. If we get, we should be 
in good shape. All right, so. I think I'm gonna go this yellow up here. Okay. If I bring the green up, no, I'm gonna bring this right down. Got my two matches and hopefully some more red will come from the bottom. I think I'm gonna try to take this side of the board first. So I'll go rocket first and he will get a half or right with some defense down. Then um, next move is important because it is the mindless attack. Um, it seems like Hathor is gonna die first because she has that a minus 350 defense and so I think I'm gonna go and also she does have the minion from Dayu Chen so I think I'm gonna go on her so I don't waste you know what I'm gonna go on Lemon Wood just because he's, he's more dangerous. All right, so then they get the uh, defense down, the Marjana, Marjana for the elemental defense down. And then, um, spark light. So now, where do I want this? I'm gonna go here. Oh boy. You know, I'm gonna go use my Shelly now and add some additional fire damage. Oh, sand damage. Let's see if I can take a little bit more down. Where can I set up my... Yeah, I'm gonna come here just to buy myself some time, see if those, if I can kill them. Okay, perfect. Now I will... I need to get the mindless attack going again. So where is the best red match for me? No way to get this red match. Uh, let's try to clean this up, see if something comes up. No, shoot. Okay, there's... I can go this way. Now this is just going to be some uh, grinding. Oh shoot, he got right in the middle. So I am going to lose both of them. I'll just get this diamond now. At least I can get rocket to get the bombs there. Okay, I'm gonna try to play a little bit faster because last time I ran out of time and that was not good. Okay, I'm just uh, waiting game. Come on, bombs explode. So that was 
was a good one in that game. All right, guys, so that's it for this war. Uh, we got 245, that's not mad, so I missed that last one, but it is what it is. All right, guys, so first of all, I would like to congratulate Seven Days Departed for the well-deserved victory. Uh, you guys' defenses were just a little bit too much. Obviously, every time that you lose a war, I think that's when you learn the most, especially if you record your, your hits. And I'm pretty sure um, the hunters here will be looking at our videos and trying to see if the opportunities for improvement are either on a team setup or board management. Uh, talking about board management, I think you guys uh, realized, especially on my fifth flag, uh, which I timed out, that I'm not doing very well speaking or talking, narrating the match and playing with the same speed that I, I do play whenever I'm not talking. I think we had several members of our alliance uh, this today that timed out as well. So not only it's extremely difficult to face some of those uh, top meta defenses, but when you're trying to talk things through and play, uh, it, it does slow down the process. I also would like to apologize for the technical difficulties we've had today. We had issues with video, audio, and then I do not do all my flags at the same time. And I noticed also that the audio quality is different from one recording to another just because I wasn't in the same location. So I'll try to uh, tie things up a little bit um, more so the quality of the videos is a little bit better for you guys. All right, guys, if you stuck with us through the end of the video, I appreciate um, the support. Please um, hit a like. If you have not subscribed yet, uh, feel free to do so. Share with your friends and uh, we will see you guys again in the next uh, war video hit.